Hello and welcome to the Nick Dinsmore YouTube channel. Please subscribe, comment, share, and give us a thumbs up. Follow former WWE superstar Eugene Nick Dinsmore on social media. Check out nickdinsmore.com. Oh man, ladies and gentlemen, listen, one of the things we're all concerned about though, Jim, and I know you've been watching very intensely here over the last few months, the situation between uh, Rob Conway and the damage of the heavyweight title on the line. We've got some film footage from just the other night. Something very, very strange happens at the end of this. We want right. the fans to make sure, pay close attention, check this out. Conway working his way back up, a couple of repeated elbows. The damage of throwing Conway into the turnbuckle, showing his strength. The damage of no lightweight out here, buddy. Oh, runs into the foot of the Iron Man. He goes back in again for the splash. Nobody home. The Iron Man with the Iron Fist. Another Iron Fist. A third Iron Fist. The Damager goes down. Treasure at ringside, screaming encouragement to the Damager. He ducks under the Iron Elbow, but gets caught by the clothesline. Ten minutes gone. Big Iron Elbow from the Iron Man. You can see the tide has turned, buddy. The damage has got to be concerned about the heavyweight title. Power slam! The Iron Man, Rob Conway, making his way back. The damage is reeling. Hold it. Briscoe's pulling him out of the corner. He's in the corner. you got to make the break when I say so. Is the information going to Briscoe. Hold it. Hold it. Treasure has given the damage is something. It looks like a chain. Conway ducks under it. Ducks under it and side suplexes the damage. You hold it. Robert Briscoe sees the chain out here at ringside. He sees the chain. The Iron Man Rob Conway trying. Oh, he knocks Briscoe down. And the damage hits him from behind. Oh, my goodness. The damage brings the chain to ringside. The Iron Man gets it. Now Briscoe's trying to get it back from the damage. The damage pushes Briscoe down. Briscoe's hit the mat twice here in the last 15 seconds. The Iron Man Rob Conway and the damage are trading licks out here. The heavyweight titles are both of them push Briscoe down. Oh, my goodness. Briscoe's hit the canvas three times here in the last 10 seconds. He's stopping the match. Robert Briscoe is cut. Double disqualification, double disqualification. The Iron Man Rob Conway and the Damager, both of them disqualified. The belt stays with the Damager. The Hustler Rip Rogers is out here working on the Damager. The Hustler and the Iron Man are double teaming on the Damager. The Damager keeps the belt. It's a double count out. The Damager remains undefeated as the heavyweight champion. The Iron Man Rob Conway and the Hustler Rip Rogers are pummeling the damage out here. Briscoe trying to get him to break. Treasure screaming for mercy. Briscoe again pushed out of the way. Hold it. Hold it. Nick Dinsmore has hit the ring. Nick Dinsmore hits the ring. He pops the Iron Man. Well, he's got that coming. I'll tell you that. This is going to say, yeah, they're right across the ring. Big backdrop from Nick Dinsmore. Again, the damage that keeps the heavyweight title. Hold it. The damage that kicks this one from behind. Oh, is it going to be brain damage from the damage? Oh, my goodness gracious. Joined here in the ring with the Iron Man, Rob Conway, and Iron Man, everyone saw the situation the other night at St. Therese. What have you got to say for yourself? Well, you know, Dean, the Iron Man rules Ohio Valley Wrestling with an iron fist. And I don't usually ask people to do anything. I usually tell them. Well, I ask Rip Rogers to watch my back, keep Nick Dinsmore out of my business. Well... He let me down. So now, I'm not asking him. I'm telling him to find another partner because he let me down. Well, now I'm letting him down because I've got better and bigger things to do like win the Ohio Valley heavyweight title. And damage you, rookie, that belt is mine. You never beat me, and you never could beat me, and you never will beat me. If it hadn't been for the referee disqualifying the match because he's just an average man and he doesn't know the punishment that the Iron Man can give out, the net belt would be right around my waist, around the waist of a winner, and not around yours. So I'm demanding another match. I don't want to have to wait because you never beat me, and you never will because the Iron Man never loses. He's the Iron Man, not the common man. Look at this. Do I look like a loser? I don't think so. Oh, they joined here with Nick Dismore. Hold on. First things first, Rob Conway. You can zip it. I hear you out here running your mouth about wanting another OVW heavyweight title shot. Well, you had your shot last week, and you dropped the ball, my man. 
you can just get to stepping because I would still be the OVW Heavyweight Champion if it wasn't for you and the damage of screwing me over time and time again. So it all boils down to this. I'm going to be the man. It's going to be me. Nick Dinsmore is going to be the one to take the championship belt off of the damage up. It's going to be me that takes the belt off of him because you're not the man the Iron Man is and you could never beat the damager the way I can. Speaking of the damager, he's in the house. Whoa, 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 pump the brakes. You two goofs are getting it twisted. Listen, Flex, you had your title shot at St. Teresa's and you missed the boat. And as far as you go, you overgrown Boy Scout, I took my title off of your waist and I said climb the ladder, so you still should be climbing on up. As far as I'm concerned, I don't care about you, I don't care about you, neither one of you are getting title shots. Wild situation. Oh, Jim making his way here into the ring, you're the man that uh, is in charge of all this, Jim. You see, we've already got a controversy. Well, I don't mean to be sticking my nose in the middle of everything the first week out, but I fired bowling for fun, but this is my job. Now, I'm supposed to do what the fans want and what's right for OVW. Now, the way I see it, Damage Jeff, you are undefeated since you won that belt, and you do have the championship, so you're the man right now. Whether you did it by fair means or foul, you're the man. Nick Densmore, you got a point. You got screwed out of that championship, in my opinion. I saw what happened, and you've had a shot, but you haven't had a fair shot. But as far as you go, Conway, you had a chance at Damage Jeff. You didn't beat him, but he didn't beat you. So you've got a point, too, so I'll tell you what we're going to do. Louisville Gardens, July 20th, we're going to put that championship on the line. The only fair way to settle it that I see is a triple threat match. <laughs> Dinsmore, Conway, and the Damager, all three of you, there's going to be no disqualification. There's going to be no count out. It's going to be pinfall or submission. When a man is pinned or submits, he's eliminated. The last man standing in the ring at the end of that thing is the OVW champion. Triple threat match for the title, and you guys sort it out. The best man wins. Wild action, Tuesday night, Louisville Gardens, July the 20th. Make your plans to be there. It's going to be wild. For more information about the Gardens card, check this out. Nick, Rob, all the crying you, you two get out here earlier. Well, I guess it paid off because Mr. Big Shot, Mr. Cornette, came out here and signed a triple threat match. Now, ever since I've won this title, I've been undefeated. I put everybody down with the brain damage. So a triple threat match, that sounds a little suspect, a little shady to me. But I'll go ahead. I'm down with that. I can handle that. Two on, two on one is basically what it is because you both hate my guts and I hate you too. But the gist of it is Tuesday night, July 20th, Louisville Gardens. I'm walking in the champ. And I'm walking out the gym, and that's the damages word. So don't get it twisted. We got action scheduled right now, making his way into the ring area from the local asylum, Cousin Crazy. And his opponent, escorted to the ring by Treasure from Seymour, Indiana, he is the Ohio Valley heavyweight champion, the damager. Well, I assure you, Dean, and I want to assure the damager, we are not trying to gang up on him. It's not supposed to be a two-on-one situation. It's wet. Hold it. Look who's climbing in the ring. It's the Iron Man. Rob Conway's telling Cousin Crazy to, to get to step in himself. He wants the match with damager. And... Hold it. Yeah, the Iron Man is in the face of Crazy. Last week it was Dinsmore. Now it's Conway. You can't. These guys. Wait a minute. Wow. He just laid Crazy out Good real quick. Good night. The Iron Man wants damager. He thinks he was uh, shorted in that heavyweight title match. Well, it looks, it looks like it'll be Conway oh, and Damage. Wait a minute. Nick Dinsmore in the ring, and he's in the face of the Iron Man. Dinsmore wants Damage. Everybody wants the Damage. Hold it. Hold it. Rob Conway said, I'm the rightful champion. Nick Dinsmore obviously reminded him that I was the champion before you. Look. Oh, man. Oh, wow. We've got a major. Whoa. Oh, popped each other. Oh, we got Nick comes back. But, hey, wait, well, we've got a match, but it's not the one that we signed. It's Conway and Dinsmore. They're going at it. Briscoe has called for the bell, and these two young guns have flat gone. Hold it, I see Treasure and the Damager have gotten themselves a couple of chairs, and they're making their way out here. They're sitting at ringside. Well, Damager, I guess he figures it's better to watch a fight than to be in one, especially in this situation. I think this blows 
uh, Mr. Damage's theory that OVW is trying to get two men to gang up on him because Conway and Dinsmore, they couldn't warm up to each other if they were cremated together. They're not going to be able to work as a team against him. It's going to be a triple threat match, every man for himself on the 20th at the Gardens. Man, that is a wild card, a big card. Plus this hardcore thing that we got coming in here. But this triple threat match, you talk about walking in the door and setting this organization on its ear, Jim Cornette. You have done that by booking this triple threat match. Well, hey, don't li listen, don't give me the credit for that. All I did was put them in the ring. They were going to get in the ring whether we signed it or not, evidently, as evidenced by this. We got a cover from a big drop kick, the Iron Man kicking out. of. Look at Damage, he's got his feet up on the rope. He's got he, everything short of popping popcorn in his mouth. Well, he is uh, obviously interested in seeing what Dinsmore and Conway's strengths or weaknesses are, who's going to come out on top of this thing, and I hope we have a good amount of television time left because this is a main event match anywhere at OVW, and you're getting it for free right here on television. You got that right. Obviously, the damage you out here taking this opportunity to scout the situation, but he's faced both of these men before. He ought to know what in the world to expect. The arrogant pin from the Iron Man, and you're not going to get Nick Dismore that easily. No, and I'll tell you this, at the Gardens, they'd better be loaded for bear, and damage you made one point that uh, he is the man he is going to have to beat both Rob Conway and Nick Densmore in that triple threat match to remain the man. As I said, there's going to be no disqualification. There's going to be no count out. The only way to defeat a man is either by pinfall or submission. When a man is pinned or submits, he's eliminated. The last man in the ring at the Louisville Gardens on July 20th will be the OVW champion. And like I said, may the best, may the toughest man win. Irish whip by the Iron Man, Rob Conway, Nick Dinsmore kissing the canvas right now, and the damage you're doing a little rooting from both sides out here. All right now, the Iron Man draws back and pops that iron fist right into the side of the head of Nick Dinsmore. Sets him up for the ride across the ring. Oh, big, big power slam. Nick has got to be stunned. Boy, I, I can hardly wait to see what, it, what the situation will be like with damage involved as well, because... There can be some two-on-one situations because sometimes there's no honor among thieves and you've got to do what you got to do with it. There's a cover. Nick Dinsmore barely getting the foot on the rope to stop that one. But at the same time, it's going to be every man for himself, every man looking out for his own best interest. And I can't think of a better place than Louisville Gardens to have a match like that. I know, Dean, you've been there for many years. I saw my first live wrestling match in the Louisville Gardens about 25 years ago, and it's still, in my mind, the best place in this country to watch live wrestling. You got that right. As a matter of fact, first time I set eyes on Jim Cornette was at <laughs> Louisville Gardens at ringside. It's been my pleasure ever since. Oh, man, Nick Dinsmore, big slam, big slam. We are under one minute in the TV taping. This is wild action. Oh, whoa, whoa. And oh. Dinsmore caught the man, caught the man, ducked the clothesline and tackled him and tossed Conway right out on the floor. And now Dinsmore has taken advantage here. German, German suplex. suplex. Oh, Conway pulls up. Can you believe it? I can't believe no one's kicked out of that. Is that the first time that anyone's kicked out of Nick Dinsmore's German suplex? Oh, my. Man, oh, man. Rob Conway, Nick Dinsmore, and then you involved the damage in it. Oh, he's got him in the rack. He, oh, look, he's popping him. He's popping him. Dinsmore got out of the rack. I've never Dinsmore seen anybody Dinsmore got do out of the torque. Wait a minute. There's Damage. Damage it with a chair. Wow, wow, oh. wow. Oh, man, these guys are going to meet Tuesday night, July the 20th oh. at the Gardens. We'll see you at ringside. Damage has laid out. Please subscribe, comment, share, and give us a thumbs up. Follow former WWE superstar Eugene Nick Dinsmore on social media. Check out NickDinsmore.com.